told you to stay away. Alright guys, today I am in Cape Girardeau, Missouri, and right behind me is a Spirit Halloween that's in an old Macy's. There's the sign, and there is where it used to say Macy's. You can just barely tell. I don't know if you can just get in here from inside the mall, but we're going in this way. So let's go see. Hopefully they have some totally awesome stuff. Ooh, and I'm getting excited. Right up front. They have a waving wally. You look like a natural for our freak show. If you need a job, I'll introduce you to the boss, but uh, all applicants must be dead. All applicants <laughs> must be dead. <laughs> you gotta love waving wally. He's from last year or the year before, I don't remember. Let's see if we can get him going again. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Holy crap, guys. Look what is on Wally. Has good childhood memories of the carnival. Follow me. I promise we will give you some new memories you will never forget. You already did. You gave a memory of a spooky bug. What in the world? Where did that thing come from? All right, Wally. Here we go with the head cut off. I, hmm, I can't think of what her name is. I want to call her Ophelia, but that's not right. Evelyn Leach, that's what it is. I could not think of what her name is. The cut off head, and look at her mascara is streaming down her face. Look, we got a Mr. Howell here for sale. They don't have him set up because I've heard that they were told not to set up any more new animatronics, but it's cool that they do have one for sale. Then over here they have the fogging skull pile right beside Evelyn Leach. Then look what we have over here, guys. Shorty. Okay, Shorty, do your stuff. I think this is only the third store I've been in this season where I saw Shorty actually set up. Usually it's uh, Sam over here and you can't find Shorty at all. Okay. I love his blue shoes. And look, he only has four fingers on each hand. What in the heck? All right, let's head back over here. We need to go through the chains of death. Chains of death we're going through. Oh, and look who's waiting right outside the chains of death for us. It's Chucky in his good guys box. I've only seen these in two stores this season. They have Beetlejuice, but it appears he was just sold and he's getting packed away. Oh, look over here. We have a shorty for sale. And we have a Mr. Howl. Oh, and we have the Spooky Works. All right, there's nobody set up in here, but it is kind of cool that you can just come in here and walk through with the spooky tunnel. What would be really cool would be as if they put some more uh, chains of death in here. That would be sweet. All right, let's go back through this way here and see if we can find anything that we have not seen in other stores. In fact, let's do this guy real quick just because he's cool. Oh crap, he's not working. But here's Ghostface with his knife to gut you like a fish. Oh, what do I see here? We got a spiky side stepper. I don't think I've seen him in any stores. Yes. <laughs> Dang, he's he's so loud. Holy crap. Okay. $29.99 for that guy. He is so loud. Let's do it one more time. That is just pure chaos. Oh, and look what we have down here, guys. They have a sweet collection of dolls. Look at this. We got the vintage Wolfman doll. And then we have the Vintage Clown Doll. We got three Uncle Charlies and hugs. Holy crap. 
All right, let's listen to him. Okay, I got this guy at home. Come on now. That's hilarious. The vintage clown doll is like the least evil thing in Spirit Halloween. That's like the worst thing he says. That deserves a pie in the face. That's hilarious. A train in the background. All right, let's do Uncle Charlie. Look at his teeth. He definitely needs the aqua fresh. Okay, let's do hugs here. Come on, hugs. I got this guy too. I got all four of these actually. Step right up, step right up. Yes, you'll do nice, very tasty. Help me. <laughs> I hope they bring the big animatronic hugs back next year. <laughs> All right. Hello, rat. Whoa, look at that. What in the heck is this? Like a giant scorpion? Yes, it's a huge scorpion. How creepy is that thing? That reminds me of like something off of uh, Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Hmm, okay, that's inappropriate. Oh, look, they have little Sam dolls. I have not seen these in any spirits that I've been to this year. Let's see here. How much is he? $27. It's a Sam doll with his uh, sucker and a bag. How cool is that? They have four of them. We have the Pennywise side steppers. Let's set them up here a little bit. Where's the button? On? Oh, there he goes. Okay, I've heard enough of you guy. Oh, and we have the Sam side steppers up here too. Look, we have five of them. All right, let's bring one down here a minute. I have this guy at home too. Okay guys, which side stepper is your favorite, like out of all of them? If I had to choose between Sam and Pennywise and the, uh, the spiky one over here, Man, I don't know. This guy is totally crazy and chaotic. Let's do him one more time. Jeez. I think that thing would send me into nightmares. So I think my favorite um, between the three is probably Sam. Because Sam is awesome, he's cool, he's cute, and he's Halloween-y. Holy crap, what is this? A light-up trick-or-treat wagon? Look at this! I've never seen this before. And if they had them in any other stores, I certainly must have just, like, walked by them or something. That is pretty cool. Okay, now these are awesome. Wait, first of all, here's a Halloween mug. Michael Myers, blood dripping around the rim, and it says, Have a Knife Day. I like that one. This one I really like. Halloween 2. Look at that. That is so cool and creepy and spooky. It's in the hospital. That's where Halloween took place. I mean, Halloween 2 took place in case you didn't see that one. And then, of course, they have more mugs down here for uh, the many faces of Michael Myers. Look, excited, sleepy, confused, jealous. That is too funny. Happy, sad, angry, calm. It's all the same face. Look at this, we got the zombie arm pathway markers. I love to see these ones. Look at that. That's like nightmare inducing sounds too. One more time. I like that. That's really cool. What if you had like 20 of these lining your pathway all the way up to your door for trick or treats? We got the hanging phantom ghost. Will it work? Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs>
That's one of my favorite things that these say, things say. There are a couple of them here. Um, well, there's this one here, and then there's a couple of them at Lowe's that say that. Oh, yes, the master will love you. <laughs> That is pretty creepy. Look at that face. It's kind of strange that they don't just have regular chains, like the regular chains of death you could hang from the ceiling. They have the neck chain with this giant thing that goes around your neck and one chain hanging down. Then they have the hooks chain, which is a longer one, but it's got these hooks on the end, like Texas Chainsaw Massacre hooks. And then you got this chain with a hanging bloody foot. Look at that. It's just a stump. Oh, they got two of the big hanging Sams. Those are cool. That head is like the size of a basketball. Oh, look at this, guys. I don't know. I could be wrong, but I don't think I've seen this anywhere else. It's the Ghost Face Party Projector. Look at that. It changes color, and it throws the Ghost Face designs all over the walls and the ceiling. That is awesome. I love Ghost Face. In fact, look. I have my Ghost Face shirt on today. Hello, Skull Funnel. Let's leave some stickers by Uncle Charlie and hugs. And let's leave some in the abandoned spooky factory section among the skulls and the spooky bricks. What in the world is this? It's a rainbow face. It's a rainbow hat. You put your head right in here, stick your face out, and you're surrounded by a rainbow. And look at these. There's a shark hat. It's like the shark is eating your head. And there's a banana hat and an avocado hat. All right, let's see what kind of masks they have in this store here. I always hope to see things in these stores that I've never seen before. And I have seen this rag doll, this Raggedy Ann and Andy mask. Um, but I've never really looked at it. It's pretty creepy. Whoa, wait a minute. What in the world is this thing? Look at those teeth. Look, what the... All right, all right hold on. I gotta figure this out. What in the world. Is this supposed to be like eyes all over this mask and in a very strange mouth with fangs? It almost looks like an Ant-Man. Oh my gosh, look, it's a vintage robot mask. Hey, there's a button too. Look at that, it lights up. Look at the mouth. <laughs> That's pretty cool. This guy creeps me out too, the wild eyes clown. Look at those eyes. Oh look, this is almost like a buzz saw. It's not the same as on the prop buzz saw, but it's still a saw on the end of your hand. Pretty cool. Oh look, I almost missed it. They have an Evelyn leech for sale here, right by the door before you leave. Hmm, I was hoping they would have more animatronics stashed somewhere around the corner, but they don't. Oh, but they do have the Uncle Charlie costume. And hugs. And Annabelle. Excuse me, sir, I've already heard from you. And Annabelle. And the butcher. And Chucky. And Freddy, although, hmm, they're all sold out of Freddy masks. They've got like this one down here, and then they got this one here, which is my favorite, Nightmare on Elm Street 4. Of course, they have Friday the 13th. Oh, look, they have a hidden ghost face animatronic over here, too. How cool is that? I almost missed him right beside the ghost face costumes. Oh, what in the world? I don't like devil stuff, but here is one that I have not seen in any other stores, guys. Holy crap. Dead by daylight ghost face. That is scary. Here's a little secret, guys. I don't do eBay anymore, but these go for over a hundred dollars on eBay. Oh my gosh, I have not seen this in any other stores either, guys. Look, it's the Despicable Me Gru mask. Look at this, look at the nose. Oh my gosh, and look at this, guys. The real monsters. It's crumb. That is hilarious. That's not even, that's like just a union suit. That's a one, one big piece, almost like pajamas. I thought it was inflatable, but it's not. That is awesome. What in the world? They even have Porky Pig. That one is inflatable. Of course, they have Hocus Pocus and Harry Potter and a few Michael Myers things, but this is really the only Michael Myers mask I've seen in this whole store, strangely. Okay, guys, that's it for that one. That is Cape Girardeau, Missouri, inside the old Macy's. I told you to stay away! Oh, my God! <laughs>